being the best dad in the world. Only one. Right from the beginning, I was blessed with you as my dad. We started our days together out west as you left for your job at Imperial Oil. A dad, a provider for your family. I was pretty young at the time, and I don't really remember, but I've heard through the family stories that you helped save my life. Well, apparently after you had heard that a young child would learn to swim if you throw them in a pool. Yeah, so thanks for jumping in to save me. Oh, and then there was a time you made sure I healed from my dislocated shoulder. You know, from the train ride. Ha ha. So, we got off to a rough start, but things only got better. A new dad and new experiences. We returned home to be with family, and you started your lifelong career at Scott Paper as a lab technician. A great place to work with benefits for the kids. I remember going at Christmas times to the fun events, riding on the ponies, getting a surprise Christmas gift, and sitting on Santa's knee, or in the summer going to fun-filled events like the egg races, the three-legged races, and a barbecue. I remember living on McKay Street up until the age of, I think, seven or eight. I remember you pushed <coughs> me, pushing on the back of my bike to help me learn to ride a two-wheeler, and it worked. I remember you helping to get me down off the rafters when I froze from fear in the garage after climbing up to there. I remember you making sure we were safe when all kinds of strange things happened in our haunted house and our strange tenants. I remember you protected us from the Sam's Pizza dude with the spurs on his boots. <laughs> what? The Sam's Pizza dude with the spurs on his boots. Remember? He was in the road and he was clicking his spurs. <laughs> I remember how you took us on the toboggan to Grammys and Grampies in the snowstorm for Christmas Day. I remember the money under my pillow from the tooth fairy, although that was probably mom. <laughs> I remember all the back rubs I gave you for 25 cents. You deserve them, Dad. I remember our Sunday drives and getting a special treat. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> I remember getting allowance for doing the dishes, and I remember going to Sunday school and church. So many great memories. Then we moved to Claremont Avenue, our real family home. Great times and memories from there. I remember you and I standing over Lisa's crib and you saying, just think you are going to have a baby brother or sister soon. I remember our tire swing you put up for us. I remember the outdoor rinks you built. I remember the basketball net Stephen put up. <laughs> I remember the garden you grew, the lawns you mowed, the house you painted. I remember the barbecues you did and many days of sitting on the front veranda. I remember the football Sundays, the Grey Cup parties, and the hockey nights. I remember the piano you played, so many gatherings, and the guitar you strummed. The singing you did. I remember Johnny Cash, Neil Diamond, ACDC, <coughs> Jesus Christ Superstar. And I remember the fireplace going. I remember the steaks you cooked over the onions, the, egg, the eggs you made, and how, many, and how you made gravy one time out of nothing. I remember you pretending to eat the delicious meal we made for breakfast in bed. I remember my Sunday morning crawlings with you and Mom. I remember the fish you fried after a fishing trip away. I remember going to I remember going with you to watch you play baseball and you pushing me on the swing. Too bad the chain broke. L O L <laughs> brings me back to my younger days. But you were always active in sports, whether it be baseball, running marathons, golfing, swimming, hunting for a bit until you decided you didn't like that anymore, yeah. or skiing. Thanks for taking a skiing to Wentworth and Mark Top. 
Lots of great memories skiing at the lodge. My favorite sport I saw you do was the Bicycle Olympics. <laughs> <laughs> I still remember it clear as day. You even did zip lining like a pro. I remember our days at Mount Murphy Beach with me on your shoulders so I could dive off. We spent many a fun time with us, hmm, with us sitting on the beach, eating our sandwiches and drinking our pop. I remember how many times you carried me in your arms after I fell asleep at the drive-in theater. I remember how you took me to the dentist and helped calm me down. I remember how you tried to teach me how to drive that night. <laughs> Good thing I took driver's ed. <laughs> Is it over yet? No. <laughs> I remember how you came to my special events like my graduation, princess pageants, and Dow graduation. I remember you coming to watch me figure skate even though I wasn't very good. I remember all the plays we saw in Anakinish and in Picto. I remember how you took us camping in PEI in Newfoundland on that very long ferry trip. I remember our boat rides and going fishing with you and staying at our camp. I remember the Cabot Trail and the screeching of the car tires. <laughs> I remember the bridges and looking at the Wawa. I remember the tall ship outings on the wharf and our yearly lobster carnival outings. When I moved to Halifax to go to university, I remember you making that special trip up to help me move all my things to my friend's house. I remember those special visits at Hoagie Steakhouse and all the special calls when I worked at the Herald just for you to say hi to me. The cottage life was fun. We had many a laugh. I remember piling all the hats on your head and playing cards and let's not forget Pictionary. I remember sitting outside on the deck and lots of barbecues and our many nights at the round table. Then our next phase, the cottage to the house. It's almost over, Steve. Thank heavens. <laughs> A big change, but the change would be the best. I remember the night of Joe Chow and you up on the cross. We laughed so hard that there were tears in our eyes and pains in our bellies. A new place and a new beginning. Trips over cliffside and to the beach. Many beautiful meals together and sitting around watching sunsets until the sun went down. Thanks for all the MVUs, the morning what are the what's that right? Morning cleanups. MCU. Oh yeah. MCU. MCU. Yeah. Major cleanups. Yes. MCU. Yes. Laundries. And and I can't make up my own writing. And cleaning, Cinder fella. Oh, and let's not forget the big day, garbage day. <laughs> <laughs> you are so smart, an avid reader of books and the newspapers, and we know how much you love the news. Thanks for all the fires and, and piling all the wood. I think that was supposed to be somewhere else, but anyway. Thanks for taking care of the house, the trees, the weeding here in, in Arizona, too. All the good laughs and good times there, too. Thanks, Dad, for all the kajillion jokes and delicious salads. Thanks for the kajillion I'll wait here to finish shopping. Thanks for all the piano songs. Thanks for teaching me. Don't care what other people think. Thanks for all the hugs and kisses. Thanks for always supporting my choices and being there when I needed you. Thanks for being my big cork. Love, Joanne. Little cork. Thank you. <laughs> Happy Dad's Day. Did you Beautiful. almost fall asleep? <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs>